To explain why only some storms suddenly intensify into hurricanes, scientist Joe Sioni makes use of a fairy tale. This is a Goldilocks situation. I'm talking slightly drier, near the surface, and that's it. His theory, some hurricanes are slightly too wet to quickly strengthen, others slightly too dry, but some are just right. Satellite sensors already show water moving high up in the atmosphere, allowing scientists to track energy. But Sioni thinks if moisture can be measured at the ocean surface, scientists will know how energy gets into a storm. That's where this new drone, the Coyote, comes in. It will be launched from Hurricane Hunter aircraft starting this summer and will fill what researchers call a data void that has hampered computer models. If we can't sample this region very well, very accurately, all the time, uh, we're, we have the potential to miss how much energy is coming out of the ocean by a third or a half. The drone will join other instruments that feed information into supercomputers upgraded last year. Still, forecasters worry human nature is the biggest obstacle in getting the public storm ready. We as humans look for any piece of information we can get our hands on to convince ourselves that we don't have as big of a hurricane problem as we really do. Katrina was the last major Category 3 storm to hit the U.S. nine years ago. But it's $7 million from 2012's Hurricane Sandy Relief Law that's being used to make better warnings for future storms. Tony Winton, Associated Press, Miami.